Hello, everyone. Welcome to Thursday's Brain Games. Today we are playing categories, scategories, and we're going to be using an online version. So you will just need to pull this up on a computer or a tablet or a phone. And the link is posted right now. If you just click on that link, all you need to do is join the game and you will be in. It will give you um, a guest name. So my name is Vulture. It'll just come up with any random name for you. And there's no need to sign in or um, make an account. All you need to do is join the game. If you're joining us for the first time, feel free to comment and tell us where you're from and how you heard of us. And while we have some time, um, next week we have a member of the New Jersey Self Advocacy Project, Ashley, will be doing a training um, called the Best Course of Action. And it'll be all about learning past and ongoing um, action alerts that you can participate in to stay informed about advocacy campaigns and um, different ways of ensuring that your voice is heard. So all, all um, self advocate points and outreach will be covered in Tuesday's webinar with Ashley. And this month we are celebrating the 30th anniversary of the Americans with Disabilities Act, ADA. So in honor of the 30th anniversary, we're asking folks to give us quotes on how the ADA has helped you. Um, the ADA has so many different things that they do for a variety of people and we have a template on our website that you can fill out with your story or any quote that you would like to give and you can email it to anyone from the New Jersey self-advocacy project team and we'll create a template for you and we'll, we will be featuring those quotes and stories all month long on our social media so if you haven't seen some of them already you can check them out on our Instagram our Twitter or our Facebook. And we're also using the hashtag thanks to the ADA on all of our posts that um, have anything to do with the ADA. So your post can be featured if you use that hashtag thanks to the ADA. And if anyone does know what the Americans with Disabilities Act is, the New Jersey Self Advocacy Project hosts trainings on the ADA and what is involved with the ADA. Um, and these trainings are free and can be done virtually. So if this is something that you're interested in and your group or your wherever you live or go to program, you want to learn more about ADA, feel free to reach out to me or anyone from the New Jersey Self Advocacy Project and we can set up a training for you. So if you are just joining in now, you can click the link and we're going to be playing Scategories online today. So all you need to do is join the game. There's no need to set up an account or make up a password. You just click the blue button that says join game and you will be given a random name and it's usually something funny. Mine is Vulture. I have my name since I'm signed in, but everyone else will be a lot more fun. <laughs> Frankie doesn't want to have fun with us, so she's using her regular name. <laughs> <laughs> the New Jersey Self Advocacy Project is also hosting a new interactive healthy lifestyles project. Um, virtual training session every Wednesday at 11 a.m. using Zoom. So these events are live and they are here to help promote good health, 
good behaviors and a good mindset. So we have some really awesome speakers coming in to share their knowledge and to lend their expertise. So we'll learn a lot of great stuff. Um, some of the classes you will utilize supplies and the NJSAP team will send any supplies that you may need directly to your location free of charge if you sign up in time. And um, if you're interested in joining this live interactive virtual program, just reach out to anyone from the New Jersey Self Advocacy Project and we can link you up to get you all set up. It's gonna be really fun and we're gonna be doing it um, pretty much to make sure that everyone is keeping the healthiest they can during the stay at home order. I know it's getting really hard. Um, a lot of us don't know when things will resume. So hopefully this will be a great outlet and a way to learn some new coping skills to continue to stay healthy while we're at home. I see we have Ape has joined us. Oh, hello Ape. Ape, if you would like to tell us your real name, feel free to comment. <laughs> We have some really fun categories today, so we're going to be able to think of a lot of great stuff. Um, if, if you're on here and you know of any of your friends or someone that you might know who would enjoy this, please feel free to share it with them. We welcome Brain Games to anyone who would like to join. And it's just a really great way to break up the week, have a little bit of fun during the day, and also a great way to test your knowledge, see what you can remember. We've got turtle now. Oh, I wish I was turtle. <laughs> vulture. I'm vulture. My father is next to us playing. He's turtle. <laughs> He's turtle. Mm hmm. You should switch. <laughs> <laughs> All right, if we have anyone new joining, all you need to do is click the link in the comments and you'll be taken to a web page where you'll see a big blue button that says join game and you just click that button, you will get a randomized ID for your for your guest. So mine is Vulture. We'll probably get some sort of animal, it seems like. And then you'll be all set to play the game. We have a bunch of different categories today, and we're looking to play three rounds. As soon as everyone's in, we'll pick a letter and we'll begin. If anyone has any questions or if you're new to brain games, feel free to leave a comment, say hello, tell us where you're from or how you heard about us. I see Ape has uh, left, so if you have it, open another tab or on your phone or your computer. If you don't look at it for a while, it will sign you out. So if you just go back to it and you hit join game again, you'll come back in. Maybe we'll just give it a moment. Hopefully they'll come back and uh, we can get started on the first one. Awesome. All right, to anyone who follows along to 
with our webinars on Tuesday. We're, we're going to continue to do them, but we are also adding in our new interactive Healthy Lifestyles Project program that we're going to be holding every Wednesday at 11 a.m. on Zoom. And these events are live and all you need to do is register and you will be able to um, be in these sessions free of charge. Any supplies that you need will be um, directly mailed to your location, again, free of charge. This is a program to help promote a healthy lifestyle, good health, healthy behaviors, and good mental health. Um, so we're really looking forward to doing this and having people join just to see what Healthy Lifestyle Project is all about. If you're interested in this, you can let me know or anyone from the NJSAP team. We got Lark. Oh. Oh, nope, we don't, not anymore. Come back, Lark. <laughs> Lark and Ape, all you have to do is um, just re-enter, just rejoin the game. Sometimes if your phone um, blanks out, it'll knock you out of the game and you just need to join again. I'll hit star once uh, we hopefully join back. Okay. going to be fun. I love categories. Me too. Ape, Lark, any, any luck? Ape, Lark, where'd you go? <laughs> <laughs> we lost you. Yeah. Maybe we'll give another minute or so and then they could join the next one. I don't get it. Okay. Oh, we got Princess Ange. Hello. Oh. How did you get your name like that? They signed in. See, they were fancy. Princess Ange, she knows what she's doing. <laughs> All right, we'll start at 115. All right, Lark, Ape, you guys have one more minute in case you wanna try to get back onto this game. All you need to do is visit that same link that you used the first time and press join game, that big blue button, and you'll be back entered into the game. Any luck, Lark, Ape? We'd love to have you back. <laughs> All right, well, I guess we'll give it a go and hopefully they'll come back. Yeah, we'll see how fun it, fun it is and then we'll join again. Yeah. Oh, actually now, maybe because I came out, it's not giving me the start button. <laughs> I have play game. Oh, okay, then you have to do it. Okay. All right, the game is starting. Three, two, one. Awesome. All right, we got three minutes. Our letter is G. And we have three minutes to answer these categories. We have boy's name, author, food, movie, Games, famous male, cartoon characters, holidays,
verbs, things you see in the zoo, bodies of water, Disney character. So just try to think of as many as you can. Hmm, I'm blanking. <laughs> it always happens, right? Mm hmm. Hmm. All right, we have 40 seconds left. All right, time is up. So now we're going to go ahead and go through all of the names or the categories and make sure that everyone has different answers. And if you have the same answer, then you don't get any points. So we have boy's name. We have George, Giovanni, Greg. And Gerard. Wow, we all thought of different ones. That's yeah. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. That doesn't always happen. So we all get a point for boys' names. Points all around. For author, um, we have good kind Terry, Gammon, <laughs> and that was it because me and Princess Ange could not think of an author with a G. And <laughs> I don't know if those are actually authors, but they look it. <laughs> <laughs> so Frankie and Turtle get points for author. For food, we have grapefruit, gorgonzola, green beans, and goat's head. Mmm, yum. <laughs> Everyone's favorite. Everyone loves a good goat's head. <laughs> And we all get a point there. So that's a good thing. Awesome. Yeah. For movie, we have Ghost, Game Plan, Gone with the Wind, and Great Imposter. Oh, these are all great. So I get it. this one. Everyone We're not even doubling up. This is imp impressive. <laughs> 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 all right. For games, we have Gin Rummy, Go, and Go Fish. I couldn't think of one for this. Oh, go Fish. Oh, and during brain games, too. I know. I was just like thinking of categories, and that's it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> go Fish is a good one, and so is Gin Rummy. All right, for Famous Male. Ooh, here we got some doubling up. We have George Washington. Great minds think alike. George was a great guy. <laughs> we have Gary Newman and Gandhi. Ooh, Gandhi, that's a good one. Nice. Awesome. Frankie and Turtle get points. 
for cartoon characters, we have Goofy, Gary the Snail, and that was it. We both got points Gary for that. I had Goofy, <laughs> but then I, you know, put it in the later question, so I didn't want to double up. Me too. That means we both don't get the point. <laughs> 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 Holidays. We have Galentine's Day and Good Friday. <laughs> oh, so Galentine's Day is creative. You guys can take a vote if you think that Galentine's Day can be a holiday. I think it's a holiday. It's not an official one, but I think it's a good one. <laughs> I think it's a good one. <laughs> Woo. All right. For verbs, we have glowed, which I meant to type glide. <laughs> <laughs> we have grab <laughs> and grind. So they all are verbs if the one first word was spelled right. <laughs> Very nice. We have things you see in the zoo. So we have giraffe. Giraffe, gnu, what's that? New, it's it's like a little, they're, 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 or I shouldn't say little, I guess. It's like an ostrich. Right? No, that's a emo. Oh. They're um, like a uh, horned creature, like a like a bull kind of thing. Oh, cool. Like an antelope, I suppose, but they, I don't know, a little different. Oh, awesome. Well, I just figured I could be. I'm not matching someone because I didn't yeah. want to have a giraffe. <laughs> Never heard of that one, so I think that was a good one to pick because I only could think of giraffe. <laughs> and gibbons. gibbons. I also don't know what that is. What is it? They're, they're monkeys. Yeah. Cool. Wow, you guys really got creative with that one. <laughs> <laughs> okay, for bodies of water. Oh, Great Barrier Reef. That one. was such a good one. I couldn't think of anything. I couldn't think of anything either. Looks like Princess Ange couldn't either. So that was a really good one, Great Barrier Reef. And then Disney character. I knew me and Frankie would have the same one. <laughs> Goofy. <laughs> <laughs> it's just such an easy one to pick. <laughs> yeah. Awesome. All right. Um. All right, should we go on to the next round? Um, yeah. It'll do the same categories and then we'll get a new letter. Okay, perfect. All right, we confirm the results and we're moving on to the next round. So this round's letter is going to be B and all of the categories are the same. So just think in terms of the letter B now. Hmm. This is tough. Hmm. 
We have about 40 seconds left. coming up to the end all right <laughs> and we're done all right so this round we had the same categories we just had a different letter so our letter was b so for boy's name we have bob billy bobby brandon wow that was good. I thought we were all going to have the same one for that one. So we all get points for boy's name. For author, we have Baldwin. Awesome. I could not think of an author. It looks like Frankie. And yeah. Turtle could not think of an author. <laughs> so Princess Ange gets a point there. For food, we came up with basil, broccolini, barbecue. Oh, that was good. And Turtle did not get a chance to write anything. All of those are food, so I think we all get a point there. Movie. Beauty and the Beast. Oh, that's such a good that's such a good movie. I couldn't think of anything. <laughs> and Brave. Oh yeah, Disney on the mind. Yes. They're both oh, that, that was great. Vulture and Turtle, no points for movie. <laughs> <laughs> For games, we have bingo, break the ice, baseball, and basketball. Surprise, we all got different ones for games. Yeah. Awesome. So we all get points. For famous male, we have Barack Obama, Barry Manilow, Brad Pitt, and Bailey Corn, John. John <laughs> Different. Awesome. <laughs> um, yeah, they're all perfect. So we all get four points for famous male. For cartoon characters, Bashful. Oh, that's such a good one. Good job, Princess Ange. We got Butters from South Park. I love and Butters. Bumblebee. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. That one stumped me a little bit. I that was like one of the last ones I filled out. Yeah, I had a thing too. And me too. Couldn't think of anything. Holidays. We have birthday and Black Friday. <laughs> so I put birthday because I think of my birthday as a holiday, but I know that everyone doesn't always agree. So we don't have to we don't have to put that one as a holiday. <laughs> I accept birthday as a holiday. <laughs> your birthday is your holiday. <laughs> and Black Friday is definitely a holiday. That was a good one. I couldn't think of any like real ones. <laughs> <laughs> so for verbs we have bounce breathing blaze and bounce oh so princess Ange and turtle you thought of the same thing so both of you don't get points for verbs that's funny right of all the verbs you can text mm -hmm. yeah bounce. that is really funny a good one i like it yeah great minds think alike yeah things you see in the zoo babies Bonobo, is that how you pronounce that? Yeah, it's another monkey. <laughs> <laughs> and a bearded dragon. Wow. I hope the babies is referring to animal babies. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Frankie's internal are definitely more accurate, but you do see babies at the zoo usually. <laughs> yeah, that's true. And also, yeah, people attending as well. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't think about that. That makes sense. <laughs> For bodies of water, we came up with Baltic Sea, Black Sea, and Bay of Biscan? Biscan? <laughs> Where's the Bay of Biscan? Florida. In Florida. Florida. Okay. Oh, I think you'd probably get two points for that because there's two yeah. points. We're not enabled to do it on here, but mental uh, note. Mental note that you get two points for bodies of water. <laughs> 
For a Disney character, we have Bambi and Belle. Ooh, good. That was a good one. Um, and then Turtle and Princess weren't able to think of anything for Disney characters. So it looks like we have finished the B list. So I'll confirm those results. We got a lot of great ones. Um, not too many doubles on this one, which is great. Yeah. This will be the last round for this set. Awesome. So same categories again, just a different letter. And this letter is going to be T. We have about 75 seconds left. Hmm. 30 seconds. All right, we're all done. That one was hard for me. I don't know about anyone else. <laughs> I definitely had to do that. I'm like, I really should yeah. be able to do this. Um, <laughs> okay. Oh, man, Frankie. <laughs> wah, wah. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I think I'll just do Tyler. I'm not going to spend more time thinking about another name. <laughs> Same. <laughs> <laughs> all right, for author. We have I Terry. went back to her good cut. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you could have done G, right? Good or I did. I did both oh. ways because you could do first and last name. So oh, yeah. apparently he's the only author I know. <laughs> That's so funny. And then Tenayson. Tennyson? Cool. Awesome. For food, we have oh three cheese pasta. That's good. And tripe. That was very smart. Me and Princess Ange could not think of anything. And we could not think of anything for movie either. I think we lost Frank Princess Ange. <laughs> Frankie did The Terminator. And Turtle said True Lies. Very good. Couldn't think of anything for that one. For games, 
Um, we have tic tac toe and twiddle winks. <laughs> twiddle winks. That is such a fun name. I love it. It is. I can't believe I didn't think of tic tac toe. <laughs> I'm surprised I did. <laughs> that's a, that would have been that's three, a three pointer. pointer. <laughs> For famous males, we have Thomas the Train, <laughs> Tom Cruise, Thomas Hardy. Why couldn't I think of someone real? <laughs> I, I kept thinking so of the famous. name Tom, and all I could think of was Thomas the Train. <laughs> we only could think of people named Tom, apparently, which is funny. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> For cartoon characters, we have Timmy Turner. Oh, Timmy Turner is a good one. <laughs> Fairly odd parents. Yep. Used to love that show. So you're making up for it with your extra points. Yeah, with my, my twos and my threes. For holidays, we have Thanksgiving. There is like no other holiday that starts with a T. I you know. Is there? There I probably think. is, but I couldn't think of it. <laughs> for verbs, we have thanking, trick, and trubus. <laughs> Tr trubus? Trounce. 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 That's another misspelling. But. Trounce. Oh, <laughs> that makes sense. That's right, right. Like we all learned a word today, huh? <laughs> all right. Things you see in the zoo. We have tigers, Tasmanian devil. Oh, my goodness. That could be scary. And <laughs> turtles. Turtle put turtle. That's so. Oh, my God. I, my brain also went to tigers, and I was like, I can't write tiger. Someone's going to write tiger. But I didn't even think turtle, and we've been looking at turtles. I know. And turtles are my favorite, so you would think that would come to mind first, but... But we all nope. have points, so that's good. And that's what matters. <laughs> Body of water, tigress. Oh, that was good. The Straits of Hormuz. I can't use the. <laughs> <laughs> he sure tried it. Yeah. <laughs> For well, Disney characters, cool. we have... Tigger, Tiana, and Trippy. Who's Trippy? <laughs> made up. He's admitted it made up. <laughs> He's one of the seven dwarves. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the eighth form that got, you know, left yeah. behind. <laughs> awesome. All right. So that completes our third round of that game. Ooh, awesome. So we have. Frankie is the winner. We oh. have Vulture in second place and Turtle in third. Awesome. And we lost Princess Ange, but, you know, if you come back. <laughs> you still have a chance. Oh, I see. There's a chat on the side and Princess Ange lost contact. Oh. <laughs> oh, geez. We're going to start a new room. Okay. Alrighty, so if you are tuned in and you saw us playing the first three rounds of categories and you'd like to join, Frankie is going to put out a new game and we're going to start up another series and we're going to have new categories this time. It'll be the same amount of time and we'll have some different letters. So feel free to join. All you need to do is click the join game button when we give you the URL for the new game and you will be all set. It will, you don't need to sign in or do anything fancy. You can if you'd like to have your own name or else it'll just give you a randomized name and you can let us know who you are. Um, I feel like I'm having a trouble here with the chat, Kelly. Would you be able to send it in? Sure.
Okay, so I just posted the new link under the Facebook chat. Um, and then I'm posting it in the B Live chat as well. So you should be able to go under the comments in the on the Facebook page under the live video and you will see the new link for the new game. Okay. If you can keep an eye on that chat, I'm realizing they weren't coming up for me. Um, yeah, no problem. Does anyone have any questions or is anyone having a hard time um, finding the new link? Yeah, just click. Just click on what you said. Mm -hmm. Thanks for joining, Catherine. I see you have to leave, so thank you for hopping on while you can. And if anyone else is viewing this, you can click the link in the comments and you'll be taken to categories for this round. And all you need to do is press the big blue button that says join game and you'll be given a randomized character And did you put the, the link in the, the public chat? Yeah, it should be there for everyone to see. Okay. I don't know what's going on on my end, but <laughs> it like stopped. After Is it, it's not it. showing up for you? No, but if, if you see it, then it should. Yeah, I see it here under the comments. Okay. Um, if anyone is listening in and doesn't see the link, comment and let us know. <laughs> All right, we'll give it another minute and see if we uh, right. have someone join. I also don't see you in there, but I'm assuming you might have got thumbed out. Yeah, I'm, I'm in there now. Okay. <laughs> I'm back. I was like, did I somehow? <laughs> <laughs> All right. We don't have any new comments, so it looks like um, people should be able to hop on this, no problem. If anyone is having trouble accessing this, um, let us know in the comments. I don't see anyone commenting or having any other issues. All right. Um... Should we do another one and then if anyone joins, we'll just start over? Yeah, that sounds good to me. Okay. All right. So the game started. The letter is I.
I is hard. <laughs> oh my is. goodness. <laughs> This is tough. 15 yeah. seconds left. Oh, I have no idea. I'm missing a lot. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's take a look at the results. Boys' names. We have Ian, Ismark. Ignatius. Oh, <laughs> that was so good. I love the name Ignatius. <laughs> yeah. It's so, so like old and I love it. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So it looks like we all got points for that one. For author, we have Ian Fleming. And I have no idea how to say that. I Ayacoco. Cool. I don't really know who that is. We like Coco, the guy who we just saw the other thing. You, um... oh, we all put ice cream <laughs> for food. <laughs> oh, I, I have cream wings. <laughs> <laughs> I have cream wings. Well, so. Technically, that is different. <laughs> um, That's so funny. I couldn't think of any other like regular food with an eye. I was like, ice cream, that's a food. <laughs> I was like, that, I mean, just now I thought iceberg lettuce, but at the time I was just like, yeah. gotta move on. Ice cream is better. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> For movies, we have Inception, iRobot, and Inglorious Bastards. Inglorious. Inglorious? Or Inglorious. Inglorious. <laughs> All good movies, in my opinion. Yeah, I've never seen, I don't think I've ever seen iRobot or or, yeah, I'm like, okay, I don't know. I like the concept. It's not, it's not really that great, to be honest. Yeah. I'm, I'm surprised I, I even thought of one with an eye. We have games, Icebreakers, and Indian, which is the card game. And I could not think of anything. So we have Frankie and Turtle getting points there. For Famous Male, we have... Ian, is that Ian? Yeah, I think you just said this, Ian. Ian Glenn and Ivan the Terrible. <laughs> there you go. Infamous. Don't know who they are, yeah. but. Ian Glenn's, uh, do you watch Game of Thrones? No. Uh, he's on Game of Thrones. He's Jorah. Oh, okay. Ivan the Terrible from the country. I've been trying to think of anything. Unfortunately. <laughs> <laughs> Cartoon characters, I am Weasel. 
<laughs> we watched Cow and Chicken, and they had oh. Iron Baboon and I Am Weasel was like a, a within it, like a little short within it. It was weird. <laughs> well, there you go. You you found a cartoon character because Vulture and Turtle could not think of one, so you get a point for holidays, Independence Day, and verbs. We have ironing imagine and irritate those are definitely all verbs <laughs> things you see at the zoo ice <laughs> impala <laughs> um depends what day you go i guess but you might see those things <laughs> maybe in like you know a penguin exhibit yeah <laughs> or if it's a hot day people will be carrying around ice maybe. yeah <laughs> bodies of water we have the indian ocean Definitely should have thought of that. Yep. Should have should have known. Couldn't think of anything for that. And again, Disney character couldn't think of anything for that. We have Aliyah. Is that how you say it? Who, who's the girl from what, Frozen? Elsa. Oh, Elsa. Oh, and... Elsa. That's with an E. <laughs> good, good thought, though. That's where my brain went, too. And I was like, oh, that's not an I. Yeah. <laughs> I'm realizing I didn't uh, pick a new list, so I'm going to actually go back. Oh, okay. Last one. Sounds good. Anyone else come join us? I just kept thinking of the word igloo. I couldn't think of anything else. <laughs> <laughs> so it might have taken you to the next round, but Frankie is, you're going to make a new game, right? Yeah. So you don't have to worry about filling this out. If you could pop it in the chat. Mm -hmm. I tried, but I don't know if mine are showing up. <laughs> All right, so we're posting the new game in the comments right now. You should see it pop up for you. And whenever you see it, you can just click on that and press join game. What did I do? It gave me the same categories. <laughs> it did? Yeah. Unless I didn't get to it. Huh. Yeah. So mm. weird. Strange. Yeah, I don't know. I'm kind of stuck on it now. Hmm. Should we play with the same categories again? Just I guess so, because I can't uh, get yeah. it. So we'll, we'll play another round with the same categories and just a different letter. Ooh. Dog sitting. Did it start for you? Yeah. Oh, I'm not in it. <laughs> oh, you're not? Nope. Oh. Uh, That's okay. You can finish it out. <laughs> I'm on a roll this one, Frankie. Oh, make me proud. <laughs>
Hmm. You have thirty seconds left. of anything else. All right, so time is up. We have for boy's name, we have Ryan and Roderick. So we both get points for that one. Awesome. For author, I put Rollins, JK. <laughs> <laughs> Rollins. Hey, are you allowed to do that? Or rolling? I don't even know. <laughs> I don't want, I don't like read Harry Potter or watch it. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, but you can do last name, yeah. <laughs> How do you spell it? Rolling, R-O-W-L-I-N-G. Didn't spell that right, so I'm not gonna give it to myself. <laughs> <laughs> Ravioli, rabbit stew, yum. <laughs> <laughs> For food, that sounds delicious. We have movie, Remember the Titans, and Roadhouse. I kept thinking of Remember the Titans when we That's had funny. tea. For games, we have roulette. Oh, that was a good one. I couldn't think of anything for games. For famous yeah. male, we have Ryan Reynolds and Roger oh. Rabbi. Rabbi. <laughs> <laughs> Rabbit, so, apparently. We, oh, Roger Rabbit. <laughs> no, Roger the Rabbi. <laughs> That could work. <laughs> we each get two points for that because got mm -hmm. double R's. Cartoon characters, Randy Marsh. Oh, more Again, mm. I can't stop thinking about characters from South Park. Um, holidays, we could not think of anything with R. Ramadan. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it feels so easy after the game is over. Right. <laughs> Verbs, we have rest and writing. Yeah. So we both get points for that. Things you'll see at the zoo, rabbit and rhino. And for body of water, we have red river. And I couldn't think of anything for body of water, so that was definitely better than nothing. And <laughs> Disney character, both couldn't think of anything. Rapunzel. Tangled, yeah. That was a good one. I couldn't think of that. <laughs> <laughs> so it's two o'clock. Should we? Yeah, we'll wrap up. We wrap up for the day. So to anyone who participated today, thank you so much for joining our brain games. I hope that you enjoyed and tested out some of your knowledge today. It's always fun to see how many answers we can think of and who thinks of the same stuff. So thank you so much for taking some time out of your day to join us. Thank you. Well, hopefully we'll see you next week. Yes. For more brain games. Yeah. All right. Have a good one.